I grew up without you, Lord. From babe in the womb, I crawled, walked, ran, stumbled through childhood to adulthood, leaking innocence, seeking for something to make sense. Accidental in nature, a drop in the human race, empty space, a hole in my chest. At first, it was confusion. Why am I here? But confusion turned to anger, turned to pain, turned to fear. From mess to mess and trouble to trouble, life without purpose felt like an endless struggle, a chasing of the wind. I made choices, decisions which led to despair. The most painful reality was that I just didn't care. I wanted to scream, to shout, to find a way out. Inherently bad. Sure, I was going mad. But then I met Phil, best friend, better half. When he told me about Jesus, I tried not to laugh, to cry, to run. How could you believe in an invisible man and his son? But slowly and surely through the years, months, weeks, nudging, hinting, curiosity peaked. My armor was thickened by years of heartache, but God's love somehow broke through. For God so loved the world. From that moment I knew. I knew there was more work for me to do. So then to Alpha, to discipleship course, to reading the Bible, searching and researching and finally stumbling across revelation of you, Jesus. Revelation that you are the reason I'm breathing. You are the reason my past is dissolving. You are the reason my life is evolving. It's all about you, Jesus. And then the opportunity came to go on mission. God, I saw your vision of the large scale transformation of the African nations. There are butterflies emerging from thousands of cocoons. But what strikes to my core, Lord, is this. It's not nations you transform. It's not large scale influence. It's individual hearts on your list. A few weeks ago, one of your children, Lord, stopped me and told me in words that were gold to me. With shining eyes, she said, his hand has been on your life for a long, long time. And right then, in that moment, it struck me full force. Transported back along my timeline, tracing my lifeline, a silent movie in reverse. But what is that? A strand of light subtly weaving in and out of my bleeding, a thread never breaking and guiding me on. God, you were with me even before I knew you. I grew up without you, Lord. Or did I? In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. I see it now, Father, my blindness is gone. My pains were the pains of growing, not knowing what you had in store for my life. 28 years of preparation, 28 years before my time came to step up to the plate. Now I am ready. I'm ready to run with endurance the race set before me, to strive that my life will bring glory to you. Your word is written indelible on a heart that's new. My chest feels like bursting a thirst nothing else can fulfill. Jesus, you're mine and I'm yours. Because you say so, I will.